Hi friends, I'm here with another haul and this is the month of March and it's currently March 27th and I got a good number of shops. I'm not sure if I'm going to get any more. I think a couple are on the way and if so, I'll include them. I got two orders from Letters to Apollo, an order from My Newest Addiction, three orders from Simply Gilded, one from the Giving Girl and one from the Pretty Pink Co. So let's okay. take a look. I'm going to start off with the Giving Girl. I just randomly selected. And if you haven't had a package from the Giving Girl, she has great packaging. It's really pretty. I really want to find a way to repurpose these envelopes because they even have score lines where you can make them bigger. It wouldn't be hard to do. I just haven't done it yet, but I do save them. So first off, we got these two freebies, and this is a February 2022 freebie. I really like these little circles and swishes. I haven't seen those in her shop, but I do know her freebies tend to have stuff that is coming to her shop. And then this is the Facebook freebie because I'm a member of her group, and that is just gorgeous. So I'm not quite sure why I got the February freebies. Um, I don't really care. I mean, I love them. But I didn't think I shopped in February. Actually, yeah, my order date was February 18th. But I got it in March. Okay, sorry about that. I had to step away. My husband was yelling at my dogs and I wanted to make sure it wasn't anything too much. But anyhow, I had to get this gorgeous kit. We go, we're in Texas and the state fair in Texas is a huge deal. And we're going to go this year. We typically go, but with COVID it's been like different. But anyhow, aren't these boxes just amazing? I love the colors. I love the girl looking at the Ferris wheel. I mean, it, this is just perfection. And she really is using her space. You have headers here, flags up here. Down here you have tiny dots. So she's making the most of every page. And she always has a very unique kit formula, I feel like. Okay, and so here you have the bottom washi, which is absolutely gorgeous. Love the font and the date covers. Oh, look at that weekly box. This is unique. I haven't seen this style of um, habit tracker yet. That's really pretty. And just a few flags. And she offsets them. Sorry, she offsets the bows. So maybe you could put an icon or some floral over there. Really awesome box page. These are quite decorative, which I don't mind. I don't know how I'd use them, but I can't wait to try um just amazing 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 options there and these may look like one box but they're actually two same up here oh i love it and what is this is this down here oh my goodness let's look at that this tiny strip down here i can't believe she cuts that out it's a tiny little dot banner and you get it on this sheet as well is it on the other sheet yeah it's on three of the sheets, so you could definitely... Oh, it's already cut, so those are tiny, tiny trims. That's amazing. So you actually get nine of those. That's really cool. I didn't see that at all. But I haven't looked at the kit, honestly. It's been put up. I haven't even opened it. Anyhow, three sets of headers. I like that she's doing this side bow. That's fun. And look at that ticket. Oh, that'd be fun to use in the sidebar. Just to represent, you know, oh goodness, it's two stamps. Oh, I love it. I thought it was all one sticker. Okay, this kit is really amazing. I love these hanging, um, like, calendar icons. Oh, look at that with the swish. Yeah, this is great. I love her kit format, new kit format. And then I picked up just a few more things. I picked on the add-ons. The Floral Deco, and it does have... Um, foil in it little dot foil but I really okay I guess maybe I did I get it in both let me check my invoice okay I did I guess apparently I couldn't figure out if I wanted it with or without foil so I ordered one of each and I, it is really cute with the foil but this will give me a lot of options and then she also had a little icon add-on, which is unique. I haven't seen that with a lot of shops. But these are really, really pretty. She calls them illustrated icons, and of course, they match the kit. So, I like that a lot. And the only other thing I added was a, a clearance item, which are these silver spider numbers. So, 
I always do that in a shop if they have a clearance section. I'll just go ahead and take a peek. Okay, the next shop I'll do is Letters to Apollo. And I think I have my orders in the right order. I could be mistaken. But anyhow, um, I got quite a bit and I got them, I think, all in black because I will fold these myself depending on what color I need. So I got the Butterfly Bunch. And then I got the Mini Butterfly Bunch. These are really cute. Uh, the Butterfly Mini Dangle. No, that's called Midi, Mid Dangle. And then you have the Mini Dangle. And then the mini clusters, which is super cute. The detail on these tiny things is amazing. You can see all the lines right there. And then the large cluster, and they're like fluttering around. These may actually be my favorite. And then the butterfly deco. And I got the butterfly frame boxes. So that was a Tuesday, $2 Tuesday order. And we'll go ahead and take a look at the next $2 Tuesday order from her. And again, in black. And I got the Simple Bunnies. And I got some egg frame. I thought these were really cute. And I got the Mini Dangle, which has the little bunny heads in it. And then another Mini Dangle. So I actually got two of those. I don't, I don't believe I meant to do that. But anyhow, I'll use them. And then I got the divider number five. I thought this would be really cute at the bottom of a column or even maybe above the date covers. I don't know. And then the mini egg and bunny dangle. This will be so cute. And I can't tell if they're connected or if they're stuck. They're connected. But you could easily cut them apart if you wanted like the straight edge and then this. Oh, and these are on transparent um, mat. Were the other ones? Yeah, they're all transparent mat. And then the little bunny clusters. And then I got the floral bunny. And I'll pull out the other bunny. So you can tell there's definitely some differences. It's the same bunnies, but these just have like floral with it. Okay. Oh, I love these. The egg dangles. Those are going to be gorgeous once I full them. So that's it. And I have more bunny stuff coming. But you know what I don't have? I don't have an Easter kit. Okay, the next shop is my newest addiction, and I believe this was new to her shop. Um, I don't think she's had these icons before. I remember there was something special about this release. So, anyhow, you get this freebie, and it looks like it's going to be transparent. Um, yeah. So, these are really pretty, but I just don't have luck writing on this type of sticker. But I'll try to find some way to use that for sure. And then I just got uh, all four foil colors and her icons. I think it was like a special. I will say these are really big. So, I'm not sure. I just wanted to try them out and see how I liked her icons. Um, I'm not sure what the sizing is going to be once I stick it down on the paper, but... I don't want to go through all of them, but so I'll just slowly scan you through it and maybe point out some of my favorites. Oh, that little four, four pack of makeup, maybe like an eyeshadow quad or something's really cute. Oh, the cheese board also is really cute. You got an apron. That house is nice. And then uh, I really like that yoga girl too. And I feel like she is a good size. So anyways, I got it in hollow. And this is her gold, which is a very, very light gold. I like it. And then rose gold, which I would say is your more typical rose gold. It's not too pinky. And then silver. So, again, I'll have to see how well I'll pull those in. The next shop is Pretty Pink Co. And she's been like a new fave of mine. I've been shopping from her a lot. I think I have three more pending orders but this packaging is absolutely gorge. And I'm trying to save that because I feel like I could so use that. But I don't know if it's going to come up. Oh, there we go. And she's also really sweet. I've had to message her a few times for different things. Never a problem. Just like I asked if she could return um, combined shipping one time or something. But anyhow. So I have a whole bunch of stuff. Let me get everything in order and walk you through it. Okay, so it looks like I got a ton of stuff. So let me go through the regular part of the order. 
I get this journaling card. Um, it's quite unique, to be honest. Not really my vibe, but I could see a lot of people really loving this. So, it has a cool uh, feel, though, texture. Okay, it looks like I picked up some $2 Tuesday items. First of all, I just got her dates in black. And then I also got her Hello Month. And her script is really pretty as well. And these are also in matte transparent, transparent matte. So if the shop offers that, that's what I'm definitely ordering from now on. But I'll still order the regular too. So here's a freebie. Those are really cute. You have a lot of what I would consider like summer flowers. They look like hibiscus. That'll come in handy. You can use this all up in one, one kit. And then I added Justine's name, which is funny because I added her name again this most recent time. But anyhow, I like it because you get a full set of the headers and then some other little items as well. Darn it, I think I said I was going to order those Swish and I did not. I forgot. Okay, so here's my order. And I got the Easter dot dividers. Man, I need to order an Easter kit. And then I got the bunny garden divider. Oh my goodness, those are so cute. I will say Easter is like my favorite holiday. I think this stuff's so cute. So I tend to go a little overboard. Okay, and then I got all the fun clusters. And then I just got some garden dividers. The mini dango. Dangle. And these are, they are quite different from the letters to Apollo. I would say they're thicker. Um, so you really could mix and match and get a different vibe. Now these are so detailed. My camera's not the best, it's just a cell phone. But man, do you see that? The little scenes. So these are the Easter bow dividers. Those are just darling. And then you just got some regular bunnies. My dogs are playing behind me, sorry. Hey Ash, hush it. And then we got the bunny garlands. And the one in the middle, they are detached. So it's each side and then the middle. <laughs> Ash, hush. Okay, sorry. I had to go take his collar off of him. Okay, so um, we got another garden divider. Some Easter strings that are individually. These are really cute. And then some um, bunny circles and Easter circles. I can't wait to foil these. These are going to be so cute. And then just some outline bunnies. So I do not need any more Easter sheets like that. Oh no, I have more. <laughs> I have the Easter uh, bow washi. And this matches the um, small detail divider. This is going to look so cute. And then I have the bunny garden. Oh, there's so many things you can do with these. And then I also got the Garden Washi 2.0. I got the Easter Garland Washi, which my thought was I don't have to use this at the bottom. I can cut it up and use it all different ways. And then Easter Dot Washi. And another Garden Washi. So those are going to come in handy. Um, granite. That's so much Easter stuff I'll never be able to use it. Okay, everything else I have is... Um, oops from her shop so this was a set of 10 oops i don't have my invoice so i can't tell you the pricing but i love these so these are little um just mini sparkle dividers they are on white so they will be a little more tricky to use but i'll still be able to use them oh i like these and then some dangle christmas ornaments very cute and so far, there's nothing like majorly wrong. I just see it has a little bit of extra full down there. I don't mind that one bit. Ooh, I like these. Yeah, and so then you just have some um, gray boxes. That'll really come in handy. And I like that with the rose gold. Oh, okay. I'm not even going to... Uh, these are really cute to mark doctor's appointments, which I actually need. That's the scopes. I cannot say it. I know the word. I just... That's, I can't say it. Anyhow, I never have been able to. <laughs> Aren't those cute? Oh, wow. And then you have some wildflower fields, which are huge. So, But those will be pretty on a day you don't have much going on at the bottom. And then the heartstring dividers, very pretty. Again, I do wish they were on clear, but I'll find a way to use them. Oh, I like these mini boxes. I like these a lot. 
I tend to like that size and they're in a fun shape and those colors seem like they'll be really useful and then I have some floral frames these will be a little difficult to use because like I said I can't really write on this paper too well so I may have to put down a box or a circle and then layer this on top of it we'll see and then floral deco some really pretty options and then little instagrams which is fun as well so i don't see anything wrong with those for a oops option perfect and then this is another oops and i think this one i got double the amount so i have 20. so i have some cherry blossom dividers i see absolutely nothing wrong with them to be honest these may just be um extras and then I have my months, March to May, which is great because that's the upcoming months. So that's, well, at least April and May. Some little hearts. You can always use more hearts. And that is uh, rose gold foil. Some cherry blossoms in hollow. Some gold circles, which these are amazing. I'm glad to have those. Nothing wrong with them. I see nothing. And then some spring dividers. Those are really cute. And silver. And then I got the cherry blossoms in rose gold. The circles. Those are really pretty. And I got more cherry blossom deco in hollow. So that's good because I'm making a little set, you know, here. Oh, these are pretty. Snowflake strings in gold. And that's even on the transparent mat. I think my sprinklers are going off. I had to go check with my husband. <laughs> Sorry, I just hear something. I was like, what is that? Okay, and I got more cherry blossom, but this one is in silver. Foliage, which is, I like this option of foliage. Um, sorry if I'm not all the way in the frame. And hollow, and I don't have much foliage in hollow, so. And then in gold, I have the... Um, mini garlands which are like little stars they're perfect and then similar but in silver and then the individual circles and diamonds in gold and then cherry blossom in hollow more snowflake clusters in gold hang on i'm missing a sheet there we go some cherry blossoms in hollow date squares in gold which we can always use more months in hollow Oh, and then some really fun Polaroid flames in gold. So I really lucked out here because um, I got four sheets of cherry blossoms in hollow. So I really need a hollow cherry blossom kit, you know. Let's see. Did I get anything else matching? Maybe in the gold. Let's see. No, not really. Maybe the deco, but anyhow. Perfect oops. Oops, I highly, highly recommend if she has another oops sale to jump on it. Okay, another thing I got from her in the oops sale was, I think it was random pull kits, and I just picked, uh, I bought two. So I don't even remember seeing this kit in her shop. It's called, I don't, Hello Fall. And all at once, summer claps into fall. So this is really, really pretty. Um, not really sure what the oops is here. I do see that this full goes up, so maybe this box shifted just a tiny bit. But absolutely nothing wrong with it to make it not usable. Like, I wouldn't have called that an oops. And then you have the box page. The only thing here is I'm not going to have deco to go with it. So I'll have to search for deco to go with these kits. But, there's, and they're full kits. I see the cuts just a tiny bit offset. But dang, you're still even getting the color. Like, it's not out of frame at all. So, this could have been perfectly acceptable to me. So, that's the first kit I got, which is great because fall's coming up. And I will use that. I do need to look for some floral. And then the next kit was a summer kit. And this is super fun. I love ombre. So, I'll really enjoy using this one. I like the girl with the um, ice cream. Isn't she cute? Oh, this is Darlin. A lot of fun colors here. I'm going to go really quick. And again, I'm not seeing anything um, wrong with these at all. So, very usable. And then you have the fun bottom washi. Okay, my sprinklers were going. I had to go turn them off. 
because uh, they already ran this morning. And I checked the program, and it's not supposed to be going, so I don't know. Uh, I'm going to start with the newest Simply Gilded order, and I will end with the subscription box. So, anyhow, I love this um, journaling card. I love the rainbow gingham. And this was her Easter order, and I just made an itty-bitty order. But I did get the freebie I want. I think these Easter eggs are absolutely gorgeous. And then I got a fun tie-dye. And then I got two rolls of washi. And I am a bit pressed for time this week, so I'm not going to um, unroll them. So, But I got the gingham single-line bow washi and then the Easter eggs, which aren't they darling? I don't know. Maybe I will unroll them. Okay, I went ahead and unrolled them because I just had to see the Easter egg washies rolled out. And they are super cute. And there's no ghosting, which I'm super excited about. I had had issues with her lighter colored washi. But these are absolute perfection. Highly recommend. <laughs> if you're into Easter like I am. Okay, the next set. This was the release right before that Easter release. I mean, I could be wrong, but I'm fairly certain. And these all came in a set. And they're just these really pigmented um, dot bow washi. I thought these would be really, really useful. And the dot is quite tiny, but the colors are wonderful. I love these colors. And I got this tie-dye journaling card, which I am not a tie-dye fan at all. Never have been, even when I was younger and it was cool. So I don't care for that, but... I'm sure a million people do. And then I think this came with a set because I think I just bought the dot bow bundle and I think it came with these. So super cute. Okay. And here is the subscription box. I went ahead and opened it because um, it has my address on top. So the theme is here comes the sun. This is like a retro vibe for sure. Very cute. And the washi box matches. Oh, I like that. Oh, and the little uh, juniper. No, 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 no. Why do I forget his name and he's my fave? Jasper. The little bunny Jasper. Oh. Oh, that pen's cool. Oh, that's cool. I like the sun at the bottom and it's definitely ombre. Very unique. And then the kit, which we know I'm not like a huge fan of. Oh, I wish I was. Just wish she would change her paper. If she would change her paper, this would add so much value to this to me. Because right now, it's just pretty much useless to me. But, and I don't mean to sound rude at all. Because what she does is amazing. So, here are the full boxes. I like the fun, childish kind of vibe. Um, I like using kits like that every once in a while. And then you have all her box and headers. We go through this every month, so I'll go quick. Some great deco, and she's getting into the few little dangles down there. Tons of check checklists. I think this is for a highly functional planner. Lots of date covers. I wish she would start doing in these in swishes rather than just the plain boxes. And some date uh, covers, nice yellow hearts. I like that color yellow. And then she, instead of seal, she did this deco, which that'll be fun. If you had like a birthday card to seal or something like that. Very cute. So that is the kit. And let me pull out the washi, which I have not looked at yet. So here are the washies and let me roll them out. Okay, so here they are rolled out you have some cute little birds and gold foil and then the sunburst and those are really pretty and this same color has a hollow gold foil i wish this one was in that hollow gold i think it would be so pretty as part of a sun then you just have the rainbows and this glitter one which i do like the glitter ones it's kind of hard to see the flowers on those but that's okay and then you have a bright yellow one. And then you have this um, die cut Jasper. Um, I ripped it up. I wasn't patient enough. But if you take your time, you can get them off uninjured. But I was just rushing. I actually need to go to work. So, so here's an overview of everything I got so far this month. Um, some great options. I love the oops from the Pretty Pink Co. And highly suggest checking her out. 
she has a new website as well so that's it if i get anything else in i'll add it to it if not i will end with all these amazing goodies and by far i do think my favorite is the um, carnival kit from the giving girl okay bye Okay, so I didn't end up getting any more sticker shops this week, this month. I think another one's going to come today, but it's already the first, so I'm going to go ahead and close out. And if you watched my last month uh, planner haul, there was a giveaway for the Simply Gilded Washi. And I had six comments, so you had a high probability of winning. And I put um, the numbers into a random number generator online and assigned every name a number. And Sarah Travis is the winner. It popped up number two, and she was number two. So she'll get that washi. And I also decided to go ahead and throw in the matching kit as well, because I won't use this. So um, that's that. And so while I was getting that prepared, I decided to go ahead and make this as giveaway as well. But this month, I'm only going to be giving away the four-page uh, kit from Simply Gilded. So you get those four pages. And like I said, I'm not a fan of um, tie-dye. So I'll throw that in the well as well. And I do not have the cellophane cello bag it came in. So I'll try to find something. But anyways, if you want a chance to enter this giveaway, just comment something below. Um, just You can even just comment like giveaway entry or something like that. And I'll announce the winner in my May haul and also tag you on your comment in the April haul. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.